Climate change is the hugest problem faced by all of humanity. This phenomenon is the mother of all problems. This event happens due to human activities such as burning of fossil fuels, deforestation, vehicle and transportation smoke. Rapid climate change has been going on for years since the late 1800s. Let's work together, citizens of Earth, for a better future. The most simplest thing that you can do is practice the triple R's. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. Sustainable development goals, SDGs, are also there as an important role and cannot be ignored. By focusing on SDG 13, climate action, with other goals, we can create a better future and effectively tackle the problems caused by climate change. Climate change can lead to quick increase in temperature, rising water levels, loss of biodiversity, food and water shortages, and issues in human health. It may seem that we are late to fix climate change, but new and advanced technologies have created solutions for us. One of the many solutions is using renewable energy sources. The most common renewable energy source is the sun, using solar panels. Right now, we are with Mr. Charles Duncan, Consultant of Renewable Energy, MK Land Holding Berhad. How are you doing today, sir? I'm fine. Thank you very much for having me and this interview. Thank you. So, sir, I would like to ask you a few questions. So, the first question is, what are your thoughts of the use of solar panels in slowing down climate change? Climate change is caused by the global warming of the Earth due to carbon level in the atmosphere. And it's very important that we try to reduce the carbon level in the atmosphere. And one of the main causes for this is actually energy. The production of electrical energy using fossil fuels like coal, gas, pollutes the environment and adds carbon to the atmosphere. We should be shifting and transitioning from fossil fuel based energy generation to renewable based. And one of the biggest and easiest will be using solar panels. Because the solar panels, as long as it's exposed to sunlight, we are able to generate renewable energy. I have heard a narrative and I quote, we are too late for climate change. What are your comments on this uh, narrative? I don't think we are too late for climate change. Yes, uh, trying to limit global warming to 1.5 degrees is going to be very, very challenging. But I think we have the technology and the know-how to try to limit it to 1.5. Yes, we may even cross that 1.5 degrees, but because of the technologies that we have, such as renewable energy and, and hydrogen and so forth, we are able to eventually flatten the curve. As we have reached to the end of our journey, it is clear that the power to change the world is in our hands. Every small step counts. Remember that our Earth is a shared home and it is up to us to protect it for the future generations. That's all for me today. Thank you so much for watching. And remember, your action speaks louder than words.